number two. You only have a, a few hours of time with the light before it flattens out. As the sun rises or the sun sets, you have that very dynamic moment where you capture the shadows and whatnot. Of course, we had a little more time because of the cloud formations, but they're constantly changing. So, you know, you have a a battle with that you have to decide what you're going to do and then carry through with that the light has changed completely you since fuck, you gotta fucking get on it you can't even fuck around with this shit anymore it's it was it's been like 10 minutes and the lights completely changed yeah. So what do you do then? Do you just keep painting what's in front of you in the moment? No, you can't do that. You now have to sort of use your memory or you just develop a pattern or something. You can't possibly keep up. No. So... See what you're saying about having to establish some sort of rhythm on the canvas. An, painting is an emergency. Yeah. Out here, you, if you don't fuck around, you're gonna miss it. Sometimes we get up in the middle of the night to go paint. I mean... I mean, when Drury and I paint, I mean, we take one look out the window, we're in the car. Everything's in the car. If I'm painting when it's like, shit's just flowing, and I'm not like, stuck on a tree or some fucking thing it works much better then you get more when, so you don't too. get you don't get hung up and, and yeah, it takes a while so you know if I don't paint like I got three or four paintings that are kind of stilted you know I'll just fuck around with them or throw them out or keep them if I make them but you know the rhythm is very very important You 
paint it out out in the desert, you gotta do the sky upside down. Seriously? So you don't drip it all over. So you turn the painting upside down and do the sky so that this line against the mountains is not so it doesn't in. So it doesn't rain. What is the name of this place? This place? Gravel Pit. Gravel Pit. And what were you painting over there? Fox Range. The Fox Range. And that's like right behind your freaking house, or no? Yeah. It seems like we hardly drove... <laughs> well, we didn't... Um, Three minutes. I could, it didn't look... To paint it by the house, there's all these... Um, you don't get a... You gotta paint the goddamn bushes, because they're in your way. <laughs> John will go all the way to a gravel pit to avoid bushes. Anything to avoid bushes. You're good at bushes now. You've, you've learned. Everybody that paints landscapes in the West, if you look at their stuff from Maine or Dixon, everybody had trouble with bushes. <laughs> Really? And then you look at them all, it is like a little dab of paint. It looks like a bush. You go, how does that work? <laughs>